Hello everybody, this is me, Manbat201, and today we're reviewing Power of the Prime Slack. Now, he is very neat indeed. Um, his mouth can kind of open. Um, yeah, that looks like he just broke his jaw. I wish it was like, it was like a ratchet joint and it had like multiple clicks. Or it was not clicking at all, like it is right here with this pin. It was just simply like, you can move it, it's a tight joint, but you can move it. But, I guess it's better than having no locking thing and it being super loose. So, yeah. And um, you can't really get any posability out of him, you know? Um, D-bends, if you count that. <laughs> uh, that's really more for transformation. And, yeah, the tail is different than the sludge. And the back is different than sludge. The front is different than sludge. The back legs are different than sludge. The head, of course, is different than sludge. And the forearms are different than sludge. Now, we're going to transform. Alright. So, to do so, yeah. it's the same as um, sludge, so I am really actually not going to go through it and just going to kind of go through the motion. Okay, you want to actually have those out. <laughs> it's a little different. Okay, so it's right here. So you do the same thing as you would do for sludge. Hold those down. And then you want to bend that, and then there's like a tab inside the joint. <laughs> so yeah, <coughs> it tabs in here. And, <coughs> to be exact, right there. And you do that exact same thing right there, and my phone went off, but that's not important. And yeah. <coughs> so yeah, it pretty much, um, yeah, it's pretty much tabs in. And yeah, from here, it is actually different than sludge in the fact that you don't have to turn his arms around they're facing the right way and now for the simple reveal and here we got oh man which just put his gun in his hands since we uh, did that already and we got the power of the prime slag now this is different than the retail version because I painted his legs silver and his face red and his eyes blue as the legs were originally gunmetal, and the head was gunmetal as well, and the eyes were red. Now, however, if you manage to take apart the Triceratops head, you can dip his head inside uh, some rubbing alcohol, or alcohol, like, I think 90%. That's what you want to use, not 100%, so don't quote me on that. And um, take off the plastic, and take off the paint, I mean, <laughs> and it will be revealed that the... Head is actually cast in this red plastic. I did not know that, but I did try to take off, take this apart so I could paint the whole head, but I wasn't able to do that. So I only painted what, what part of the head you can see. As actually turning his head is a bit of a challenge. So yeah, it can turn, but it's limited to about like right there. That's about as far as you can really go. And yeah, his arms can move 160 degrees. They can move out that far. The legs can move out about that far. The knees bend about about almost 90. And yeah, oh yeah. And we'll just compare him with his other Dinobot. With the other Dinobots we reviewed so far. Let's just, let's just go back a bit. I'll just move these so I can fit Snarl here. And yeah, they all look great together. Now I wish the legs were different on these two over here. But they did change a lot to make them different enough. So yeah, 
I just wish they had different guns as well. But yeah. The retail version of him, paint scheme wise, if you like the toy, you will enjoy that. But if you like me and like the cartoon, you will need to do a few paint apps for him and Swoop to get the best versions of them possible. But if you like the toys, you got it for him, Swoop, you might have to take them apart and paint that chest red and the eyes red, which you're going to need a really small brush to do that, as I don't think his head easily separates. And I wouldn't try, try taking the head off the ball joint if that is on a ball joint, which I don't know. And I'm not going to try that, as that doesn't look fun. I'd probably end up breaking it if I did that. But I don't want a toy accurate swoop, I want a tune accurate swoop, and now I have it. So yeah, that is your Power of the Primes Dinobots. Now that's not all of them. We still got Slash over here to review. And Grimlock. And yeah. This has been Review of Power of the Prime Slag, or Slug, as he's called now, but it's still Slag, to me, and everyone else. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> this has been me, MadBat201, and I am out. Peace.